Well, here at the opening of the new hotel, I've got Trevor Hemmings with me. Uh, this is part of your group, isn't it? It is, yeah. This is a, a new, uh, lovely hotel that we built here on the island. We did have the Grand Island in here, as you perhaps remember. Mm. And sadly, the, the more repairs we had to do, we found it very bit disappointing because the, we couldn't remove the dampness that was quite often on the beds that, that, due to the nature of the age of the hotel. So we did say at the end of the day we'd try and build one here next to, on Moorag Park because it's such a gorgeous position. I mean, you know, I, I was involved in centre parks and I used to build all the centre parks throughout the world. And I said to myself, look, with the park next door, with the boating lake, with the yachting, down the road is a swimming pool, down the road is a bowling alley, all this land, all the rugby, all the sport and the sea there, We've got we've got a mini one, yeah, yeah. so we have thought right, perfect. We'll build it here. Of course, it's beautiful inside. The sand is excellent, and I think people are very surprised if they when they come and have a look. And we are opening for viewing um, this week, following this opening. We open I think midday till eight o'clock Thursday, midday till eight o'clock on Friday, to give the public of the island a chance to have a good look. And what about you yourself? Are you taking things a bit easier these days? Oh, yeah. I'm only doing 10 hours now. <laughs> a day. <laughs> no, I know. I'm, I'm still very busy and very active and, and, and love it. Um, I love the, the fun of being on the island. I've, I've been here since I knew, well, my first visit was 1952, you see. So I know a little bit about the island, man. Yeah. And then we built here in the 1960s. And then I went off as many people do um, to earn a living and um, and eventually I've come back to where I felt comfortable and I love it and so it is your home oh it's my home yeah yeah but I've always had a soft spot for the island you know as you do yeah. uh, I love it yeah um, so plenty of banter and fun and the odd the odd little pub it's nice it's nice <laughs> have you got any more plans for doing anything else i mean obviously oh, the yeah. grand island site is going to be sorted isn't yeah it? We, we're pl planning applications gone in for the grand island and we will develop where as a, as and when you can because the economy is not good at the moment as you know um, derelict properties never never benefits i we just like to hope that this helps to ignite the mm. the ramsey area and, and make it more beneficial for commercial businesses to come and go and fill up, you know, take up hopefully further investments in it, in in Ramsey itself. I mean, with, with all the hoo-ha with the UK and everything, you must be caught up in all that all the time, are you now? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. What yeah. they want of you and, and oh yeah, yeah, all the time, all the time. We've, we've got a lot of businesses over in the UK. Um, a lot of people wouldn't realise that we've got about 600 pubs in one group, 14 hotels, of which this is now the 14th in, in classic lodges um, and one of the things we're doing on the opening which is special which nobody really knows and it won't know until I start speaking in a few minutes but I'm good to have got an early preview yeah. is that we're providing holidays for carers um, we're going to open providing holidays for carers because we feel it's an earlier opportunity during the early opening weeks to give a lot of people who mostly live on the Isle of Man who care for people a break and uh, we have a lady here from the UK who's from the Carers Trust Carers Trust incidentally is the Princess World Trust for Carers and Crossroads merged uh, which makes it a stronger body and they've identified this hotel to give breaks so it's lovely putting back into the community oh, yeah, yeah, you need to do, you need to do yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, there you go. We're not talking another time about Gigi's, I think. No, no, I wouldn't bother about Gigi's. No, no. <laughs> I was lucky enough to have um, a horse, as you know, winning okay. silver yes. uh, with Zara Phillips on. That was us. And we had a lot of fun with uh, Sue and Eddie Davis, who equally had successes. So that was down at Greenwich. Yeah. So, yeah, great. Great for the island. I mean, people don't realise just not. Not only have they got cyclists, they've all sorts of other yeah. Yeah. people to contribute. So it's nice.